so good morning. We have Tim Monat working fervently to mononatize my bus. Say hello, Tim. Hello, You're Tim. Tell him what you're doing today. Well, what we got here is a stick of barn wood. And we're going to make some doors out of it. Um, so what I'm doing is just basically cut some squares out of it so it fits in the hole. Fucking A. And what do we have over here? We've got hinge mechanisms. So we started with this chain that we found in the barn. And because we have articulation, that's going to allow us to hinge them. So part of the problem was once we create this hinge, obviously that's too big of a hole for a screw. So we found this old plumbing strap. And Teresa's been working her butt off to make all these little bitty washers out of it that fit perfectly in the space. So we'll put a screw through there and we'll have a hinge that is literally off the chain. <laughs> You're so funny. Barnwood, barnwood. Now we're gonna go inside and look at what he's done so far in just two days and a quarter of work. We have stunning kitchen cabinets. These are the doors and the drawer materials that he's cutting, but so the hinges will go right here, right here. This is the door. This will be a drawer, obviously. Same thing over here. You can look at the kick plate is all from one piece of wood, and it looks beautiful. In addition, we're going to, this wall that separates the kitchen area from the bathroom is going to be all barn wood. And then we're going to have cabinets that run along here that are barn wood. He framed this out. This is a, um, this is this part section here. This is in the bathroom. This section here is going to be um, a linen closet, storage closet, whatever. Um, there's the bathtub. He framed that out. We're going to put some... Um, plywood behind that and then waterproof it we found some really cool old big huge bolts that once we get it waterproof we're going to put the bolts through on our four corners to hold hold the tub in place when i'm driving down the road here we have the composting toilet that's good to go and um the closet that i haven't finished yet but i've decided to leave all of the woodwork to Tim since he can do it much much faster than I am and I'm working on electrical and plumbing um, because the next thing that we do is put a hole in the floor for this sink but oh and the neat part is underneath the stove I'm just gonna build a, a, a slide out I think is that still the plan uh -huh. so it'll basically be a drawer that's inverted so you have a platform on top which will cut holes in that will allow these to sit in there so instead of having to get inside this cavity and try to hook everything up she can pull it out and have everything sitting right there where she can pop the connector off and off one. of one to the next one and then just and slide it right back in again that was brilliant um, anyway that's all for now have a nice day stay tuned for more